What's happening folks? It's your guy Rashad out here at Action Sports Bar and Grill. Action Food Truck in Kent, Washington with another follow me to work, day in the life of a food truck owner, bar owner, restaurant owner. Uh, today's video, it was Jill's birthday, our general manager. Yay! So for Jill's birthday, we uh, it happened to fall on a small business Saturday for us, which is something we started up during COVID time in an effort to try to support local and really showcase small businesses that are in our area and really just to spread some love. So uh, this gave us a chance to shine the light on a couple of Kent businesses that we frequent and like a lot. Uh, for us, you know, like I said, it's about spreading love. We would much rather form partnerships with uh, neighbors rather than uh, create competition. So uh, as always, if you enjoy the video, please give us a like, comment below, check out our socials or stop on by. So many good cakes. I'm getting something, I don't know what yet though. Yeah, we didn't came up. I'm glad I stopped in too because uh, we were gonna go get a spa gift card, but they were in between sessions or the owner wasn't there. Well, it turns out the owner was inside Tweet Themes getting treats for Mother's Day. So just another small business owner keeping it with a small business owner right in their neighborhood. I love it. These guys are great here, Maggie's and Meeker. They're awesome. Really good breakfast. Have to come down and support them another time too, but they solid. So we were over here, the plan was to get a gift card for uh, Jill's birthday. And you see the sweet thing box, that's actually not mine. It is the owner of the spa, Jamie. <laughs> we were lucky enough to catch her over there and come back to her beautiful spa, uh, which she bossed all the way through COVID building and fitting this place it's a beautiful space for relaxation and uh, to come in and just uh, give it a little stuff a little break pamper yourself with a the treatment they do facials they got massage they got wine treatment i'm just going to give a quick little tour i didn't really ask her if i could but i'm going to do it anyways Another Kent business doing its thing down here. Kent downtown, small businesses, the scene is lively. So when you're down here, come check out All Aglow Spa. Let's go find the balloons. I wonder if that might be the place with all the balloons in front of it. Let's see. That does appear to be the spot. Oh, but I don't think they're open. Well, we was gonna come give them some love. I will get online and see if maybe I can just order something. Order something for them. Hashtag we are Ken. Dang. All right, well, let's 
Let's head on over to KJ's Cakery and Buds and Blooms. Get some flowers and some more sweets. I should probably get one of these little coffee signs too because this is real life. No coffee, no worky. That could be Jill all day long. Also, anything coffee related, basically, that woman will, will love. So maybe we grab one of these little signs. This is a very, very cool little shop. I've actually not been in here. A woman owned business this is a black owned business so if y'all are ever down in the area you know you gotta slide through a lot of cute little shop with baked goods they partner with local vendors and other small businesses to bring in candies and other infused treats they got some macadons back there some ice cream sandwiches a bunch of sweets so you know I'm like a kid in the literal candy store right now so uh, like i said it's jill's birthday we trying to support local and at the same time support my fat kid habits so i uh, came down here swooped up a little offering of everything from them they got some vegan choices i did not go that route because i'm not a vegan nothing against my vegan friends but i take all the animals and everything so, rooted to the tuna as my pops used to say <laughs> All right, well, we up back across the street from our place. I came up here to get some tasty dough and get some desserts and deliciousness for uh, the celebration tomorrow and also to support local. But they're right next door to my favorite teriyaki spot in the whole freaking state. You understand what I'm saying? In the state, and I eat lots of teriyaki. I've been to lots of teriyaki joints. But these guys right here, Kamitsu Teriyaki in Kent. Excellent is right. They make their own gluten-free sauce. Not that I care about the gluten-free, but it's just so damn good. The sauce is great. You got Nana Southern Kitchen is across the street. They fantastic in this parking lot too. But a little, a little, a little spendy for me. So you know, they, I splurge for them. And then we right across the street over there. You can barely see over by the McDonald's over there. But these are our neighbors, so you gotta show love to your neighborhood first and foremost. So I was gonna get tasty dough, but Humitsu's right here. Still gonna get tasty though, but I'm gonna go into Hamitsu and order food for the crew today. Um, we like to feed the regulars at the rail sometimes, so I'm gonna get a couple of chicken teriyakis, because those slap. They have the best chicken katsu I've ever tasted in my life, so I'm gonna get that. And then uh, me and my brother might short, split a short rib, so you know, we're gonna do that. And then I'm gonna get everything in tasty though, everything that makes me fat. Already got Sweet Themes and KJ's Cakery already in the car, but we about to just take it up a hole Never level. I know it might seem like I'm in the same spot, but this is actually a different bakery. A totally different bakery. Now we're at Tasty Dough. These guys are more of a French style type of bakery so their macarons are ridiculous moose towers pretty solid cupcakes but I'm here for the macarons and the best freaking cream puffs and eat players around so see three different bakeries but they all got kind of different things they do excellent eat players so Ooh, and it looks like back there they got some chocolate. Yes, they got chocolate pastry cream. So that means I'm about to do some of these cream puffs with both of them. The vanilla and the chocolate pastry cream. 
Might be the best thing they do. I think we're getting 20 cream buffs. I think that's how that's going down. Sport local. That's how we do it, y'all. So these are baklavas with pistachio and hazelnut. We've got a coconut rolled one down there, a honey pastry. These are pistachio baklava. So I'm gonna try out a little bit of everything. You know how we do it. I like sweets, so let's go. And then over here we've got strawberry cake. We're gonna try that one. We're gonna try the chocolate one up there. Got lemon, they've got it's like an apricot. Uh, yes, ma'am, please. Yep, so a strawberry one, yep. And then they got cookies over here. And one of each or yeah, one of each of the six, the six, yeah. So I think that's pistachio with chocolate on top of the apricot, that's strawberry jam and coconut. This is strawberry jam, chocolate, and vanilla on top. Got a rice one with poppy seed, got a pistachio cookie and an almond cookie. And I think those both have apricot jam in it. So we're gonna try it all out. It's a cute little shop in here. I like it. So uh, we had Rose Bakery, we had Tasty Dough, we had ooh, Sweet Themes, we had KJ's Cakery. Did I say Tasty Dough? Yeah, because we had them too. And then Hamitsu Teriyaki. Um, I was gonna get photos and video of everything, but we ate and it was hot, so uh, the food was hot, so we handed it out to the guests and to the staff. We all tried some of everything. Everything was fantastic. It was cool to try some new things that we hadn't had, um, some baklava and, uh, you know, we sampled everybody's cookies and pies and cakes. It was freaking delicious. So, uh, mission accomplished. Um, we're gonna the the uh, boss is going to get the rest of the day, day off for her birthday and uh, she's going to go enjoy herself and uh, yeah uh, our small business Saturday was a success because well um, we got everybody in camp we tried to hit everybody so uh, oh and yeah how could I forget that she got an hour long uh, massage coming at uh, plus sauna treatment coming at All the Glow Spa which is also in downtown Kent so uh everybody chipped in and uh you know we spread the love uh, buds and blooms forgot about them got some flowers too so wasn't able to hook up the balloon love shop uh we'll look online and see if there's we got a couple more events coming up got our anniversary three-year anniversary coming up for the bar so maybe we'll link up with them for that but yeah good day uh should be busy busy tonight so uh yeah just getting back after it. I felt bad that I didn't have no afters really to show you, so I'll have to, I'll have to, I took photos. I just didn't take any video. So I will uh, try to figure out a way to edit photos in. That'd be dope. I'm sure it could be done. I just don't know how to do it yet, but. Um, good thing I'm a pretty, pretty fast learner. So we'll see, I'll get some editing software and start working on that and we'll see if we can slide some pictures in there so y'all can see all the stuff that we destroyed uh, collectively as a crew. So.